surprised a cookbook doesn't burst into flames in your hand. <laughs> oh, Francine. In the flesh. Mm -hmm. Speaking of flesh, yours is looking finer than ever. Stop it. <laughs> We're in church. Uh. Keep it G-rated. You look good, too, though. I know I do. So I didn't know you remember Pastor Carver's congregation. Well, this is, uh, this is my first time, so... Yeah, well, if the stories I'm hearing are true, you could use a little church in it. Oh, well, if memory serves, you could use a little dip in some holy water, too. Oh, really? Really. Oh, stop it! <laughs> I want to talk to you about family. Yes. For it is a father's joy to care for his child. Yes. It is a father's duty to protect his children. Yes. And it is a father's pain to see his babies in need. Just as God cried out through his prophet Jeremiah, for the hurt of the daughter of my people am I hurt. Yes. I am blessed. Yes. Yes. Astonishment yes. hath taken hold on me. Yes. Is there no balm in Gilead? Hallelujah. Stand up, yes. people. Yes. Watch over your family. Yes. For just as the Lord provides for his children, yes. we must all provide for our children. Hallelujah. But you see, but you see, tell me something. Is such dedication, is it easy? No, no. 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 Is such dedication, is it fun? No. 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 But I tell you, I tell you, such dedication is necessary before the eyes of God. Hallelujah. Uh, hallelujah. What happened with um, the cute little thing, the um, sports attorney? Monroe McManus? Yeah, what's going on there? Nothing. I heard the ring belonged to the fiance, but south of the border was all yours. Who told you that? Well, the New York buyer's more gossipy than a sewing circle. Uh, you got that right. Anyway, I really enjoyed the sermon. Yeah, you really got into it there. Why, was that too loud? You're always too loud, Kevin. All right, I'll pray for you too, Sister Francine. This one too. She can't forget this one. She's got to bring it. This one is wild. Kevin, enough. Are you sure you're all right with this? Yeah, I'm fine. I mean, you know, it's a little, it's a little weird, but uh, after everything that Melanie's been through, this Jerry cat, he seems, you know, like he's the real deal. Well, I hope so, but, you know, I'm not going to sleep until she's back. Well, it's just an overnight visit with her mother. I mean, this guy, he saves souls. I'm sure he could change a stinky diaper, right? Okay. Hey, come on in, y'all. We're just packing her up. Look who's here, baby girl. Look who's here. Francine, why are you, why is she here? Francine's a good friend of ours as well as our attorney. Is there a problem? We thought it best Miss Prescott to be here with what we had to discuss. Discuss? What's so to di discuss? What's happening here, Melanie? I think Jerry should explain it to you. Now, having had a chance to observe Sarah's environment, the alcohol, women, homosexuality. Hey, George, take the baby away. What are you saying right now? I'm saying that I think that Sarah should be raised in a moral and intact home. Like yours? Melanie is Sarah's biological mother, and I intend to legally adopt her, something which you never got around to doing. And I guess running you at the church, that was just a coincidence. I know you're upset, but you must realize this is for the Don't best. try to handle me, Francine. I know how this game is played. And you, you think I'm a sheep in your little flock, waiting for you to come off the pulpit and save me? Brother, it's not like Don't that. call me brother. Don't even speak to me. Look, if we can't handle this amicably, it's going to go to court, and then it's going to get nasty. I've gotten nasty with you before, Francine. We can do it again. Now, y'all get the hell out of my house. Now, we got to fight. What if you don't win? We're going to win, George. No one's going to take that little girl away from me. 